We are live from Atlanta, Georgia's Dirty South Dome. And I noticed they've cleaned this place up a bit. Yeah, I remember finding a lot more severed fingers in my chili last time. And there were fewer bodies to step over in the men's room. Place is kind of losing its character. I miss the shit sandwiches. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's gonna have it all. The Blitzburg Steelheads battle. The Atlanta Vultures. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitro here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down green street poles and eating all-you-can-eat horseshit buffets from the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. Hot one, hot two, hot three. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Full man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt. And oh, nice hit. First and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they and they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, and the ball falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Oh, thank you. I do my part. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns it on the... Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hey, welcome to McRoy Rage. How can I help you? Yeah, I'll take a double Roy burger, large Roy fries, and a big Roy dough. Uh, anything else? Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go when you want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. First and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Man, oh man, he hit that line 
the way your wife hits the all you can eat. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. Six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. You can't keep a good mutant down. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? First down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. It looks like the defense handed our shrinking pill. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And the defense holds that pass play to only two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. Third and four. Let me tell you, getting shocked is no joke. I used to wear triple wolf socks, slide around on a shed carpet for eight hours so I could shock my younger brother. Change the TV channel. You 
running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. Almost intercepted. Third down and six. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Huh? It's a fair question. At this point, with multiple... This guy's a brick shit. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. the defense it's not too often a quarterback gets rejected that's why that's the position i originally tried out for i want to know what it's like for other people to accept you and that went from a joke to making me feel feelings stop it this isn't a place to feel feel and he just popped his eyes in the back of his head that quarterback can be hurting or dead <laughs> warming up and he just wrestles away nice kick up for six yards now well, here comes the punting unit you know punters really do know how to party bricks yeah oh yeah i have pictures that uh that, well maybe I actually shouldn't discuss this on here and he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. And there.
there's another pick. Man, this quarterback might... You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Dirt in some butter dogs. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Was good for an easy kill. Third and four. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And they line up for the extra point. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Graham, will you tell the interns to get us some franken-dogs and a couple of beers? I'm dry over here. I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, at least they can pee for me, too. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? He could go all the way! And he put the Jets on and caught him from behind. Hey, yeah, uh, Briggs, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. And the offense defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and that ref is dead. You know, maybe they should consider hiring blind refs. But they get safer for them. If they can't see the play, they can't blow the whistle. And if they don't blow the whistle, they don't die. Can't argue with that logic. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And another interception. This One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Yeah. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And that pass is good for about five yards. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second down and five. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, 
Hot two, hot three. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that's constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling... I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes, I like it. Like a patient prison break. And like Brick... Oh, man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And the That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Second down and two. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. And they're catching up. Joke, job, do something. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. And one saver there. It's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. What a game is this close as the score indicates. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And he punched his way out of that tackle. And it's first and ten. one in for the first down oh holy smokes he just killed that player with a cheap shot that's why we love the mfl and it's first and ten and that's how you run the football first down And it's first and ten. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. He is fighting for every yard. Boom. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. See this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Second 
broken down and long. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Roid Rage ignites that deep down violent rate. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The 10. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And that player just transformed. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkeys getting wrapped in on his bad side from that bad burn he had last year. Yeah! <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but... This guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Well, that was a good throw. Yeah, if he was aiming for the ground. Second down and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he made it. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes oh devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Mark. Of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. First down. Give this guy a few catches and 
and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. up a new set of downs and it's first and ten I don't know whose eyes the QB is using but can we get him some new ones oh he just got crushed First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And the defense gets another pick. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math. Hey, you killed ref. It's not murder if they have it coming, right? Take the hit. Do something about that ref, you pussy. And it's first and goal here. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. away from the pass marker that's a good clue that something's not right second down and ten hot, hot one hot two hot, hot. and he catches it for six yards good mitts on that play bricks his fingers are like a bunch of sausages Third and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest. I don't see a chance in hell in here. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brett's match stumpsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Guns Up. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. I've had it. I'm running out of excuse. And he's running like a moose. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Oh, with a brutal hit! First and ten. Hot, hot one. Two, hot, hot. 
That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He says, I'm taking you with me. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this win. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, he just made mincemeat out of that guy. Hey, what is mincemeat anyway? Is it like bologna? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get a sandwich. Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They just be. The kick is good! Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! First and ten. All oh, week the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB, the offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have been... Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Bricks. Dad, there's a bloody red head on the field. No, that's their red penalty marker, Bricks. Looks like this one's coming back. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it. First down and five. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's all those power to grin. What the high cool? He'll be 
shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And a deep pal with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really... Oh, my God, a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> First down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't wrong in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Broke free and has open field in front of him. And the quarterback goes into a hurry up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Now it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. And the quarterback signals for a hurry up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? How many times do we have to He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Uh, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't gonna think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. This guy's a brick shithouse. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, three. Two minutes left in the game. Hang on. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least.
first half of this. Hot one, hot two, hot three. At this rate, oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Grim, can I kill him? His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. But he refuses to go down. Caught for the first down. And it's first. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned that, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. So well on that play, he should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. He could, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Forfeit the game because all their quarterbacks are dead. There's no one left to throw the ball, so this game is over. Wow, that's one way to win a game. Kill all the players on the opposing team. Eh, don't seem fair, Grim. Hey, life's not fair, dipshit. When it's not kicking in the head, it's kicking in the balls. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of course. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. The kicker is going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The Deadlander of Vultures win by forfeit today. Man, they destroyed their competition. They mutilated them, Grim. They mutilated them. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There
There's only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. An alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.